Hey guys, this is a video in my TI-30XS multi-view tutorial series. In this video, I'm going to address why your TI-30XS multi-view calculator may be giving you wrong trig answers. Without further ado, let's get to it. We know that sine of 90 degrees is 1. However, if I type in sine and then uh, 90 and close the parenthesis and press enter I get an answer that's uh, not one and the reason this happens is that my entry is in degrees while the calculator is in radian mode and I can tell that the calculator is in radian mode by looking at the upper right corner of the screen where it says uh, RAD for radian to change this I'm going to press the mode button and the mode screen comes up and you'll notice that radian is highlighted in black. That means radian is selected. The cursor is blinking on degrees and if I wanted to move the cursor around I could always move it around with the arrow but I want uh, degrees to be selected so when the cursor is blinking on degrees I'm going to press enter and now degrees is highlighted. Uh, let's exit the mo uh, mode screen by pressing second mode to quit and uh, to get the entry uh, get, uh, the, to get the most recent entry just press enter and the calculator just takes your last entry and enters that. So sine of 90 now we get that as 1. A similar problem might occur if you were typing in an entry in uh, radians while you were in degree mode. So for example, if I do sine of uh, pi over 2 and press enter, I get this as the answer. But that's not right. So if I go to mode and shift it back to radians uh, and press enter, and then press second mode to quit and press enter again. Now I get the correct answer as one. Another mode that you can possibly be in is uh, this mode, the gradients. So I just want to mention that a gradient is an angle measurement where one gradient is one hundredth of a right angle or 90 degrees. This basically means that there are 100 gradients in 90 degrees. So right now I'm going to select the gradient option. So once the cursor is blinking on gradient, press enter and then quit the mode screen. Now if I type in sine of 90, press and close the parenthesis, press enter, the answer doesn't come out to 1. But if I do sine of 100, close the parenthesis, press enter, I get the answer as 1. And that's because there are 90 degrees in one 100 gradients. So I just wanted to point that out. Hopefully this helps in some way. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section and I'll try my best to help. If you haven't already, please subscribe, check out other videos on my channel, especially the graphing and scientific calculator tutorial series. And until next time, take care guys.